Collecting rent seems like a no-brainer when it comes to why owning real estate is a good idea. But buying physical property can be quite confusing and costly for individuals. A great alternative to that are real estate investment trust or a REIT. In today's video, we'll go through the highest paying REITs starting from 5.5% and ending with our winner paying over 6.5%. Now a REIT is an investment that owns and manages income generating real estate properties such as shopping centers, apartments, and office buildings. By law, REITs must pay at least 90% of their profits as dividends to people that own their stock, which makes it a great investment for people who want a steady stream of income and are worried about the current market issues. In today's video, we're picking the top five REITs paying us a great dividend and are positioned well for when the economy turns back around. REITs are amongst the first place investors see higher returns when the stock market bounces. So it makes sense to start adding some of these right away. And why not those that pay us the most to get us started? Now starting off our list with healthy dividends is Kilroy Realty Corporation, ticker symbol KRC. Now Kilroy Realty Corporation was founded in 1946 and went public in 1997. Their main business is in the West Coast area, primarily San Francisco, San Diego, and Seattle. They work on the acquisition, development, and management of office and mixed-use properties in those high-growth markets. Basically, they buy buildings they think are in places that will see more people moving to, and they make the buildings better. One of the ways that the company works to make them better is to focus on sustainability initiatives. Think things like installing solar panels and other energy efficient ways to protect the environment. Kilroy Realty's values are in the right place for investors looking to go green. Some of the more notable buildings that KRC has developed are the Pacific Design Center and the gas company Tower. By adding this to your portfolio, you have the satisfaction of owning some of these cool buildings and having a sustainable mindset company. Oh yeah, I almost forgot. This company also pays us a 5.52 dividend yield just for owning their stock. Next on our list, we have Boston Properties Incorporated, ticker symbol BXP. Now Boston Properties was founded in 1970 in Boston, Massachusetts, of course. Boston Properties may sound like a REIT that holds most of its real estate in Boston, but it actually owns a lot of properties across many major US cities, notably New York, San Francisco, and Washington DC. Their main tenants, the people who rent the buildings from BXP, are tech companies, financial services firms, and government agencies. Now along with their diverse holdings geographically and customer-wise, Boston Properties' long-term strategy is to own and develop top-tier properties. Now, these properties attract high rental rates and retain high quality clients. Like most of the companies on this list, they too want to protect the environment and have done energy efficient things like installing solar panels, having energy efficient lighting, and heating and cooling systems. Boston Properties steps it up a notch though by achieving what's called the LEED certifications on their properties, which means that the building has been designed and constructed to meet high standards for energy efficiency and environmental sustainability. To top it all off, Boston Properties pays a 5.8% dividend yield. Next on our list and probably the biggest, we have Simon Property Group, ticker symbol SPG. Now, Simon Property Group was founded by brothers Melvin and Herb Simon in 1960, and they started developing shopping centers in the Midwest. Currently, they own properties like the Mall at Short Hills in New Jersey, the Galleria in Houston, and Woodbury Common Premium Outlets in New York and Las Vegas Premium Outlets. In 2010, Simon Property Group became the largest shopping mall owner in the United States but that's actually not all they do. In addition to their location in the United States, in 2021, they announced their plan to acquire a large shopping center operator in Europe, the Clay Pierre, for $25 billion, adding it to their already expansive international property line, including properties in China, Japan, South Korea, and Australia. Now I know many of you may be thinking, well shopping malls are going out of style. 
Simon Property Group believes in the shopping experience, including such malls as the King of Prussia Mall in Pennsylvania, which features an indoor ropes course, bowling alley, and movie theater. In 2020, Simon Property Group acquired Taubman Centers, which has a focus on luxury shopping. Also, they have a lot of partnerships and collaborations with fashion brands like Nike to host events. So they don't just own properties and collect rent. They use their properties in different ways to work within the malls to make them even more money. Simon Property Group also works on their image with technology. They've created a mobile app that allows you to shop, browse their store directories, and access special promotional offers as well as loyalty programs. While it may seem that Simon Property Group is in the dying industry of malls, they're certainly positioned well for the changing landscape of the modern shopper. To top this all off, they're paying a healthy 6.11% dividend just for owning their stock. Not a bad reward for owning some of that prime real estate. If you like these kinds of videos and want us to find different kinds of stocks for your investment portfolios, be sure to let us know what you're interested in. And if you want to get started investing in some of these names today, you can for just $5 using the Weeble app and their fractional share purchase program. So with just $25, you can get all five of today's companies and start earning dividend income right away. Now the last two names on our list are paying well over 6% and are in the healthcare business, so definitely room for growth in the future. Coming in at number two, Physician Realty Trust, ticker symbol DOC. Now this is a younger REIT and was founded in 2002. Physician Realty Trust is a REIT that focuses primarily in the acquiring and developing of the healthcare properties like medical office buildings and outpatient clinics. Physician Realty Trust works specifically within the healthcare space, and while they own more than 200 medical office buildings and 50 outpatient clinics, Physician Realty Trust focuses on buying medical buildings to make them better. Like all the names on our list today, they focus on sustainability and protecting the environment when they are improving the buildings that they buy. While they're a relatively new company, only being listed in 2013, they've already made great progress in both their business and their passion for company culture. Being named one of the best places to work by the Milwaukee Business Journal, and it's included in the Fortune 1000 list of the largest companies in the United States. Now, DLC is a company that is in healthcare and in sustainability, and being a REIT makes it a great stable investment to add to any portfolio. Plus, that 6.3 dividend ain't so bad either. Next on our list, rounding up and paying out over 6.5% is Healthcare Realty Trust, ticker symbol HR. Now, HR does have much of the same building types as DOC, but it's a little bit more older, a little bit more mature. Starting in 1992, they own and operate over 250 medical office buildings and 30 outpatient clinics. While HR still values the environment and makes their building sustainable by installing solar panels and using the available energy efficient technology, HR differentiates itself by building strong relationships with the medical professionals in their buildings and providing support and resources to help them succeed in their business as well. Now, HR has partnerships with healthcare systems like the Vanderbilt University Medical Center and Duke University Health Systems to develop and manage healthcare properties. HR has a strong track record for growth and they've recently bought a few other healthcare REITs recently. More notably in 2018, a REIT that I once owned, Medical Property Trust, and in 2020, the Amicus Healthcare REIT. HR, like our previous REIT, Physicians Realty Trust, is positioned well with a little bit higher dividend. This might be the name you're looking for if you're looking for a company with a bit more experience and a little bit more dividend. And that dividend comes in at a 6.59% dividend yield. All right, that tops off our list for the top paying dividend REITs that you should buy right now to take advantage of the potential bounce in the stock market. For more dividend paying stocks, be sure to click our playlist of all the top dividend stocks that you should buy for your portfolio. And we'll see you there.